Welcome back to the fourth and final part of a league of their own on Sky One HD. Let's have a look at what happened in the tennis. What a compelling fight. Oh my. I mean, that had to hurt. And yeah, look yeah. at this. I don't think I've ever seen anything like this. He was, in fact, later knocked out of the tournament by himself. <laughs> now, we finish with our quick-fire round, where the time our teams get to answer questions is determined by how long they can sustain a sporting challenge. Let's see what they're up against tonight. It's a race walking challenge. Please welcome the woman our teams will be trying to keep up with, Commonwealth gold medalist Jo Jackson. OK, now, Jack and Bish, you're up for this one, so please go and get changed. Off you go. Jack Whitehall and John Bishop, ladies and gentlemen. All right, now, whilst they're doing that, I'm going to go and have a talk with Joe. So uh, I'll come over here because I've always been fascinated by fast walking. So, um, <laughs> hi, Joe. I'm Hello. James. How are you? Hello. Nice to meet you. Now, you've already achieved your time for the Olympics, right? In 2012? Um, yeah, I achieved my qualifying time in May. And there's really specific rules yeah. for this, isn't there? Can you talk us through what they are? What, um, John and Jack are going to have to do. Yeah, there's two rules to race walking. The first one is you have to have one foot on the ground at all times. Right. So that's your difference from running, walking. Mm -hmm. And then you have to have a straight leg on contact until it's under the mid. Of oh, your so body. when it goes out, it has yeah, to be straight. That has to be straight. So how do you train for this? Do you just go constantly nipping <laughs> to the shops for people? <laughs> yeah. and go, oh, we've run out of milk. Sorry, I've got it. <laughs> If I did that, maybe, that maybe that's how I could improve on my uh, training. Now, I'm really <laughs> into it, fast walking, because I've, I've, got, I've got a feeling that it might be my sport. <laughs> right? I've got to, so, will you show me how it's done and I'll, and I'll just... Yeah. We'll have a little go <laughs> together, OK? Right, so let's... Yeah, start this out. All right, so... And, OK, and then... Because I think... <laughs> See, if I was wearing the gear, you wouldn't know which one was the Olympian. <laughs> See, but you haven't got much of a wiggle. Uh, well, Why aren't you wiggling? Because it's not about the wiggle. Yes, it it's is. Not. <laughs> Without the wiggle, it's pointless. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, Joe Jackson. So they'll go first. Please welcome back John Fisher. <laughs> okay, so John. <laughs> John, all you have to do is keep pace with Joe on the travelator whilst your teammates answer questions. And remember, any running and our judge here over here will disqualify you, okay? Are you happy with this, John? Are you ready? I am. Okay, all right. So, your time will start when Go you're Jimmy. up to speed, okay? Off we go. Okay, your time starts now. Name the last three European Ryder Cup captains. Uh, Colin Montgomery, Nick Faldo, and... Uh... Oh, sorry, is it? No. Bernard Langer. No. Name three Northern Irish golfers who have won majors this century. Darren Clark, Roy McIlroy. Here we go. Yes. Name three Harry Potter films. Prisoner of Azkaban, Chamber of Secrets, Philosopher's Stone. Correct. Name three teams Wesley Snyder has played for. Inter Milan, Ajax and Holland. Yes. Name three premiership clubs with birds on their badges. West Brom. You played for two of them. Oh! Nice oh. Well done, John. That was incredible. Back you come, John. I'm going to be honest, I didn't think that was going to be that hard. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see exactly how hard it was in a slow motion replay.
things you got wrong with the last three European Ryder Cup captains were Colin Montgomery, Nick Faldo and Ian Woosnam. Oh. And three premiership clubs with birds on their badges. West Brom you got, Liverpool, Tottenham, Swansea, Man City or Norwich. Well done, Red Team, you scored three points. Well done. <laughs> now let's welcome back from the blue team, Jack Whitehall. Blue team, Jack. You're going to be able to keep up. <laughs> Jack, you need six points to win. Are you confident? Easy. All right. Nice. Walk in the park, mate. All right. Best of luck, Jack. Best of luck, Freddie and Georgie. Your time will start when you get up to speed. And remember, no running or you'll be disqualified, OK? <laughs> Disqualified because you started running. Let's have a look at your fall from grace in slow motion. <laughs> well done, blue team. You got four questions yeah. right, but that means tonight's winners are the red team. You're in the league in your own right. Georgie and Jack, Race Walker, Joe Jackson, and of course, Houdini the Hawk and James Thorne. You've been watching The League of Their Own on Sky 1 HD. Until next time, good night.